As a joke, many would tell you that the China's biggest export is not its goods or services, but the giant panda. You may have often seen world leaders using pandas as props and photographs, but did you know that the Chinese use it as a tool of diplomacy? Our next report shows how the bear is China's biggest soft power abroad. It was perhaps one of the most photogenic moments of the G20 summit. Angela Merkel and Xi Jinping revealing China's newest ambassadors in Berlin. Two giant pandas. Some well-known world leaders have been photographed with these adorable pandas. They don't just make for good photographs. These bears have a considerable diplomatic responsibility on their furry shoulders. Pandas are China's biggest soft power abroad. They are given by Beijing as loan to its allies. The right to host a panda is hard-earned. Beijing restricts them to a rather exclusive club. China uses the panda as its ambassador and it reflects Beijing's close and smooth relationship with the host country. Such is the power of the panda that the Chinese president himself signs all loan requests. And like all loans, this too comes at a price. China charges $1 million every year for each of the pandas it sends abroad. An additional $400,000 are charged to the host country for every newborn or cup bear. China began using the panda as a tool of diplomacy in the 1950s. The Chinese consider the panda as a national treasure, giving it the status equivalent of the British royal family in the country. As Beijing rose in the global pecking order, it began using the panda as a tool, sometimes even to express its displeasure. In 2010, China recalled the widely popular giant panda Tai Shan from Washington, D.C., refusing a request from the national zoo officials to extend his stay for another year. Experts believe that this was in retaliation to President Obama's meeting with the Dalai Lama at the White House and the decision by the United States government to sell arms to Taiwan. Evidently, this furry photoprop is China's most important diplomat. Bureau Report, Beyond.